Hey, first grade art friends, it's Mrs. Herbe. I don't know about you, but I have never been to the Arctic, so I don't really know exactly what the habitat looks like where the polar bears live. So what I thought I would do is I would show you guys some pictures of the polar bears in their natural habitat so that today when we create our artwork, you'll have an idea of what the water and the icebergs look like. In this first picture, we have a polar bear and if we notice um, the edge of this piece of ice, it's kind of jagged. And then over here, we have another iceberg that's kind of floating out in the middle of the water. I also want to point out to you guys, there's this line that goes across here in the picture. And this is called the horizon line. And what this is, is this is where the sky, which is up here, meets the water which is right here. And the horizon line is horizontal. So all of the lines that we are going to be thinking about today are going to be horizontal lines. Here's another picture of some polar bears and they're hanging out on a piece of ice. And again, I want you to look at the shapes of the icebergs. And we're going to be ripping paper today. And a lot of um, our ripped paper strips will kind of mimic or look like the shapes of this kind of ice. Here's another picture and you can really notice the horizontal lines formed by all the different pieces of ice. In addition to the flat pieces of ice um, that the polar bears are walking around on, we also see some larger kind of ice chunks. And these shapes right here kind of look like the shapes that we ripped last week. Here's another one of a big polar bear on a kind of a big piece of ice. And again, we notice these kind of wavy horizontal lines um, for the shape of the icebergs. And then we also notice some ripply kind of horizontal lines and some different colors of blue for the water that the ice is floating in. Here's another one with some horizontal lines. And again, notice the funny shapes of these big chunks of ice and those kind of will look like the shape again the shapes that we ripped from the white paper last week. I have a couple more pictures to show you of the polar bears walking around on the ice. Another thing I want you guys to know is that um, the ice um, up where the polar bears live is starting to melt because of global warming and so the bears don't have as much um, ice to walk around on anymore. So it's kind of a shame um, that this is happening. Here's a couple more pictures. Um, also, today we're going to be adding some details to the edges of our ice, and I wanted you to kind of notice how the edge of this ice looks right here, and sort of somehow some of the edges of the ice looks right around in here, and in here you can kind of see um, some lines here. And last but not least, this is the last picture um, of a polar bear in the Arctic that I wanted to show you. So I hope these pictures inspire you um, as we create our own Arctic habitat for our polar bears today.